Are you new to ADP? This short video will guide you through the new user registration process. Good luck and have fun. To start off, you will receive a personal registration code to the email address you've provided to your employer relations specialist. So please make sure to check your email. The email will come from security services underscore no reply at adp.com. If not in your inbox, make sure to check your spam folder. This email will contain your personal registration code, unique to you. Please note that your registration code is time sensitive. Ensure to complete the registration process by the expiration date noted in the email. Click on the URL link provided or follow the next few steps to navigate to workforcenow.adp.com. In addition to your personal registration code, you will also receive an associate ID from your assigned employment counselor. If you have not received an associate ID, please connect with your employment counselor. Now that you have your personal registration code and associate ID, open a browser window and please keep in mind that the preferred web browser is Google Chrome. In the search bar of your browser window, type workforcenow.adp.com. You will now be directed to the ADP login page. Scroll down to the new user section and click on create account. You will be directed to a new window. Select I have a registration code. In the next page, you'll enter your personalized registration code and you will then click continue. The next few steps include you completing the identity information section, the contact information section, and a few additional steps before your account is complete. And if you have not received your personal registration code, please connect with your assigned employment counselor. Moving on to the identity information section, Enter your first and last name followed by the associate ID. You will then click continue. In the contact information window, enter your primary and backup information. This is important should you forget your password and need to regain access into your ADP account. Once completed, click continue. We are now in the last few steps of the account creation process. In this window, you will create a user ID and password. Make sure to follow the password criteria. Accept the terms and conditions and click Create your account. And remember to store your username and password information in a safe location that only you have access to. Before your account is complete, you'll need to select your security questions and answers, then click Continue. Your account setup is now complete. Please navigate to workforcenow.adp.com to test your new account and make sure that you are able to sign in. Thank you so much for dropping in and listening to this quick video. And remember, we are here to help. If you have any additional questions or need further assistance, please reach out to our administrative payroll team.